Hey everybody, it's hey. our week three summary. So week we've... three summary. It's like, hold it still. Right, so we've been out here for 21 days now. Today's the 21st day, right? Today's the 22nd day. Today's the 22nd day, Yesterday she said. was the 21st day. Anyway, so this week we spent a lot more money than we probably should have. <laughs> so we'll start out with our gear. Okay, but let me like... <laughs> <laughs> Let me preface this with but... the weather has been awful. You guys will see that in the videos. So yeah, so we stayed in a lot more hotels this week. But anyways, I'm going to start with gear. Gear, so we bought new rain jackets. Check out those tan lines! <laughs> okay. And some other stuff. Rain jackets, a sleeping pad. Oh yeah, and a sleeping pad. Yep. So that was two ninety four fifty two. So that was a lot of money. The hotels and hostels, like we were saying, that was a lot of money too. Two fifty six, fifty five, and of course, since we were in town, we ate at a lot of restaurants, <laughs> so we spent a lot of money there. One ninety three, eighty one in restaurants. That was a uh, five rest, yeah, five restaurants total, and also five hotels. Um, the resupply, so we just had two resupplies. One was like a small resupply, one was a bigger one, but we spent one hundred and eight sixty five on resupply. So not too bad. Uh, last time when we were in Franklin, we spent, no, when we were in Hiawassee, we spent $90 just for one resupply. So that was like two, one and a half resupplies maybe, and yeah. we spent the same amount. And the Hiawassee resupply was like for three days or four days. Yeah, and this is for five days, so it's a lot better. It's a lot, yeah. Um, the souvenirs, $1.30, so it's not, very, not a very big category but $1.30. And then for tips, we just have $10. Uh, we tip Chica and Sunset's 10 bucks because they were so helpful and because their place was really nice too. Yeah, and they took the packages to the post office. And yeah, 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 they, they really helped anywhere us Anywhere we wanted to go, yeah. Last thing, transportation. So transportation, we didn't really spend any money in actually getting anywhere, but we had to spend $40 for the Smoky Mountains permits. Yeah. So we figured that was our way of being transported through the Smoky Mountains. <laughs> yeah, we had nowhere else to put it. <laughs> so transportation, but it's Smoky Mountain permits, $40. Yeah. The total for all of that was nine hundred and four eighty-three. dollars So we spent almost $1,000 in one week. Uh, keep in mind, that's two people, but still $500 in one week. That's uh, a lot of money. That's half the mon monthly budget. In one week. Um, <laughs> ideally, we would have spent less, but, you know, we had to upgrade some gear. We had some gear issues this week. And um, also the weather again. So, yeah. So overall this week we went from Rock Gap all the way to the Fontana Hilton. So that was 60.3 miles this week. That puts our average at 8.6 miles per day. And that included two Nero's, one into Franklin, one into the NOC. And we stayed at gorgeous stays, not, we didn't actually stay at the NOC. Right. And then one zero in Fontana Village. The second zero, which is today, will be on next, next week's, week's budget. So yeah. uh, that brings our miles, our dollars per mile for this week to fifteen dollars. So we're shooting for a lot lower than that, like yeah. five dollars. <laughs> so, yeah, that's pretty bad. This so week. hopefully next week we can be at like one dollar, and uh, it'll make up for it. So overall for our running totals, we've done 165.9 miles and we spent $1,699.18. So we have one week left of our summaries and our week four summary will also include our monthly summary. So it'll be a little bit longer. It'll have what we'd spent this four weeks and then, you know, running totals for everything for the whole month. Um, how much our mileage is for the month, not just for the week and stuff like that. Yep. So we've got, yeah, one week left and we've got about $300 left of the $1,000 per month. So hopefully we'll uh, not spend it. <laughs> I guess we'll find out next week. Stay tuned. Bye.